At this bustling market in Thailand, stalls are teeming with people coming to buy papaya. Green papaya is the main ingredient for som tam. The salad is one of the Thai's favorite dishes. Sliced green papaya is tossed into a mixture of lime juice, garlic, fish sauce, spices and other ingredients. The Thai people just can't get enough of it. Organic papaya is becoming popular because of its better quality and taste. Farmers say organic crops produce a superior harvest as a result of fewer pests and diseases. Environmentalists warn that the country's papaya is threatened by contamination from genetically engineered varieties. In 2004, Greenpeace reported that conventional papaya fields around a GE laboratory in northeast Thailand were contaminated. The research centre was also illegally selling GE papaya seeds to farms across the country. The action prompted the government to order the destruction of all papaya trees in the trial plots. Environmentalists say GE papaya has not been properly assessed for human consumption and environmental risks. They're worried that the government might lift the ban on GE crops. The United States is putting pressure on Thailand to open the door to more GE products. Hawaii is the only place in the world where genetically engineered papaya is grown commercially. In these laboratories at the University of Hawaii, the US government conducts research on GE crops. American scientists developed GE papaya, which was designed to resist ring spot virus. In their recent report, Greenpeace says the introduction of GE papaya is damaging export markets. GE papaya was introduced in 1998. Since then, most of the countries importing papaya from Hawaii, including the European Union, Japan and China, have rejected GE crops and foods. The industry in Hawaii is in severe decline. Um, since 1997, which was the last year there was no genetic crops in Hawaii, the industry acreage has decreased and the product sales of papaya has dramatically dropped. The GE industry here is a classic example of a failure. Genetically engineered papaya seeds contaminated non-GE crops throughout Hawaii. Organic farmers in particular have been badly hit by the GE contamination. The GE papaya is much more susceptible to black spot fungus and we have to spray t every 10 days toxic fungicides. The contamination has spread all over the islands and farmers are forced to clean it up. So today we are beginning that clean up around the islands. The farmers invited Greenpeace activists to help get rid of contaminated papaya from their fields. They warned that the introduction of GE papaya into the environment comes with severe consequences. In Thailand, more people are learning about the possible dangers of growing GE papaya. Thai scientists reported the presence of an antibiotic gene while developing GE papaya. The United Nations Food and Agricultural Organization recommends against the use of such genes in the production of human food. Some farmers have been told they can no longer grow papaya without paying royalty fees to the American owners of the seed patent. Environmentalists warn that GE papaya is only the first of many GE crops which could flood the country. Thailand's food security is at stake.